Welcome back with Chef Ricardo back in the kitchen one more time again. I have one snapper left and I say I want to do something for Black History Month because Black History Month is coming up very soon. So basically what we want to do, we want to do your nice lovely escabee fish. Which you know when Black History Month come you can sit at home and enjoy with the friends and the family or some neighbor, some sister, some you know what I mean, someone might fly from Jamaica or some part of the world to come and visit you. So guys, today we're going to show you how you can do yourself a nice lovely snapper be fried fish ah it's gonna love it it's beautiful it's the best of the best and i know a lot of vegetarians that love fish like myself i love my fish man i love my snapper and don't remember don't forget you can get a copy of my cooking book it's on amazon and it's on wn you have waterstone holidays bookstore online if you go you can get it and buy your price the price won't change visit my website my blog website at chefricardocooking.com thank you so much for watching my cooking program Bye -bye. as you can see as I said before, I have one snapper left right here, guys, and I love my snapper fish. So basically, I have some fish seasoning with some coarse pepper, which I'm gonna use right here. So if I get some pepper and just put it on it just like this. Some people just use salt and pepper, but sometimes I like to give my fish a little flavor, and I'm gonna just simple basically. Just use my knife and cut it down like this. I'm already cleaned it up, but I did not cut down in between. Put some of the seasoning them down inside of it and rub it just like this. Then what we're gonna do at the moment, um, to be honest, I have a medium-sized frying pan on the stove with some oil inside of it getting really hot. So basically, I'm just gonna simple. You don't need any salt because what happened? The fish seasoning do have a lot of salt inside of it. I'm already ready ingredients and it do have salt and I don't like my things too soft. So today, we're gonna do you some Black Easter Month Escobee fish. Enjoy the recipe from Chef Ricardo. Thank you so much. Nice and lovely. So right here, I have a medium-sized front pan with some oil inside of it. So basically, I'm gonna just pop the fish in it and I'm gonna fry it for roughly about a good 12 to 15 minutes. Look at this. The oil is pretty hot, guys. So basically, you can do the same thing at home by frying the fish like what I'm doing. Fry for roughly about 15 to 20 minutes on a medium size heat. In the meantime, we're gonna cut up some seasoning. Nice and lovely as you can see the fish are fried. Roughly about 15 minutes now of this fish frying. Because I wanted to fry it properly, so I didn't give it a very long time to fry. So basically I'm gonna take it out now and put it on a plate and then we're gonna fry we're gonna saute it up some seasoning. Basically, all of the season which we're gonna use the season we're gonna use right here. We got scotch bonnet pepper carrot and some mixed pepper, fermented seed, dry thyme and piece of garlic, little white vinegar, little salt, little sugar and a little bit of oil. Now we're going to saute them off in and now, right now guys. So this is the Black Easter Month Escobie fried fish from Chef Ricardo Cooking. Thank you so much. Nice and lovely. So I've got a medium sized front pan right here on the stove. Just a little pinch of vegetable oil. Not too much because you don't want to of a choice with the iron. Nice one. So, pretty little bit warm at the moment. So, basically, next what we're going to do is simple. Get all of your veg. We should just cut up carrot, peppers. Looking so lovely and nice. Just saute them off for about two to three minutes. You can cut up your pepper if you do like I did not cut up my one. You know the reason why? When the pepper gets into your eyes very and it makes it sneeze a lot. But you must cut up the pepper, to be honest. But I didn't want to cut up my pepper, seriously. If you want to cut up the pepper, please use gloves and the safety kit. A little coarse pepper, a little bit of white vinegar, and a 
Kaffee ist Bruder Sugar. So, now this is finished. Nice one. Right, here's a fish. That's the carrot. Some people put okra. Some people put also uh, potato and all those things in inside of it. Get a nice lovely flavor and a nice lovely taste. This is the bad boy. The only thing I didn't have is a lemon, but guys, you can get lemon to put on it to be honest. Please enjoy the recipe, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Thank you so much for watching Chef Ricardo cooking program. We've got a lot more recipe like this coming out for you. Black instrument is coming up very soon. We did a fried fish to show you guys. You can have this with some hardwood bread or with some crackers or with some rice and peas, plain rice. Whatever you like, you can have it with. So enjoy the recipe, subscribe to the channel and leave your comments. This is black instrument recipe. Fried fish and have it with some hardwood bread or whatever you like, even some Cook banana or cook dumpling, whatever you like. So enjoy the recipe. Thank you so much for watching Chef Ricardo Cooking Program. Bye bye.